How to boost FPS in Valorant Go to Windows Search and type Background Apps. Turn off Background Apps. If you want, you can turn off them manually. Right click on the Valorant icon, Properties, Open File Location. Copy File Location. Go to Windows Search and type, Graphic Settings. Turn on Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling, click Browse, and paste the file location. Click on the Riot Client Service icon, and press Add. Go to Option and select High Performance. Go to this PC, Local Disk C, Find Riot Games folder, Open Valorant folder, Live. Right click on the Valorant.exe icon, Properties. Check Disable Full Screen Optimization. Change High DPI settings. Check the Override High DPI Scaling Behavior. Now change settings for all users and repeat the process. Apply, OK. Go to Windows Search and type Task Manager. Go to Start up and disable softwares you don't use when you are in the game. Do not disable Vanguard anti-cheat software because you won't be able to play Valorant. Go to this page and download this free software. Install it. Launch Malwarebytes anti-malware software, click on scan. It will take a few minutes, the software will clean your system from malwares. Quarantine, done, close the software. Now download this simple but effective software from GitHub, link in the description. Extract it. Right click and run as administrator. Type Y if you want to disable, and N if you want to keep it enabled. If you make frequent payments through this computer or laptop, I suggest you leave this enabled, so type N. You can safely disable FSO globally. Open the NVIDIA control panel and adjust desktop color settings. Increase digital vibrance to 85%, the game will look more vibrant and you will see players much better.
go to Windows Search and type Game Mode Settings, and be sure it is disabled. Now launch Valorant, go to Settings. Turn on Raw Input Buffer. Go to Graphics Settings and turn on Multi-Threaded Rendering. Set everything else on low. Go to stats and show client FPS and server tick rate, everything else hide. Restart PC. Enjoy the game.